I don't mean to start any political arguments or anything, but Roe v. Wade, Elon Musk, COVID, vaccine, Joe Rogan, climate change, Twitter, Joe Biden, anti-vaccine, ivermectin, global warming, Dave Chappelle, Amber Heard, Bill Gates, U.S. farmland, Supreme Court decision, GOP cover-up. Um, hey, thank you. Yeah, you know what time it is. 45. Ooh, bold number. First shot by Dog Rules. Three, two, one. Narrowly avoiding some TNT, bouncing on a trampoline into the muncher's mouth. 30. You want 30. Going lower. Smart. Second shot by Dog Rules. Two at 10? You're demanding two more shots at 10? Well, you, who do you think I am? You know what? This is your final shot. Congratulations. You reached the lowest, Dog Rules. No. Give me an angle. 30. Dog rules, I have a deal for you. You can have one shot at 30 or two shots at 10. I'll take two shots at 10. Let's go. Let's see. Trampoline into a TNT. Looks like he's getting some distance, but stops slowly at 500. But I went with 30 just to be the ultimate sigma man. <laughs> Give us something. Oh. Jesus. You guys will unlock something soon. I can feel it. RNG can't fuck you forever. Are we still allowed to call you the B word? Bitch? Boy? Bus? Bald? Oh, yeah. According to Bloomberg, calling a man bald counts as sexual harassment. According to a UK employment tribunal. Thank you, United Kingdoms, for looking out for us bald folk. Can I have your consent to call me bald? You're only allowed to call me bald if it's in a sexually harassing manner. Sexually harass me. Calling a male colleague bald isn't harmless banter, but sexual harassment. You ever wake up in the morning looking for something to be angry at, so you, like, shake your fist like you're Arthur from the old... Cartoons. Is it harassment to call a female bald? Yes. You're bald. I just sexually harass my wife. Because your head looks like a penis tip. My wife is asking if you've ever seen what a penis looks like. If anything, you could argue that my the top of my head when you don't see my face could look like a very smooth nutsack. It's too firm. Have you say my nutsack's wrinkly? Would you say that firm and smooth are synonymous? No, no. Okay. You may be bald, but you're also ableist. Does that cancel my victim status? I also have a chronic illness, Doru. So because I am allegedly ab ableist, I'm bald, and I have a chronic illness, and I'm coughing, I think that my level of victimality is on a heavier side of the scale to balance it out. Let's see. We have an unbanned request coming in from Cyberina. I heard people with a really big penises unban me. Why do you have to call me out like that? Now I can't unban you. I'm gonna be honest, Mr. Cheesy Shoes. When you said I'm European, I thought the next thing you were gonna say is there's never enough mold. Look up our cheese caves and tell me we don't have enough cheese. Cheese caves? What the fuck is a cheese cave? It's a cave where they make cheese. It's an actual thing. It has something to do with humidity. I gotta look this up. Hold on. Okay, so this isn't what I was expecting. Okay, so this right here is a cheese cave, right? They just store a bunch of cheese here. Now, what I was thinking when I heard cheese cave was this. But instead of honey, it was cheese. And instead of it being bees, it was like cows. Turns out reality is usually just disappointing. Like, I was imagining cheese like dripping from the ceiling, not even fucking lying. <laughs> you can imagine cows walking around with aprons and masks, pushing their cheese carts. Their little cow wings. Fucking cows have wings to fly and get the cheese off the ceiling. I blame the American education system. We have an unban request coming in right now from Nerva Knight. Every type of cheese, Abbe de Bellic, Abbe de... So anyways, it's not like it's a fucking opinion that's like controversial. It's just, you know, maybe I wanted there to be a mythical place that had cheese growing on the walls inside of a cave because I wanted to experience this place for myself. Maybe we just haven't found it yet. It could still be out there. <laughs> Yogurt swamps. Okay, now you're making shit up. The ice cream tundra. Dude, we are getting dangerously close to bug snacks territory. I'm sorry, I promise to never be gifted a sub again. 
I realized I was wrong and I'm quite cold and I'd like to come in now, please. Welcome back, Anonymous. You know, someone came in the other day and they're like, why do you have such a high count of bans? And I guess like there's some website where you can track who bans the most people. And apparently my channel has like one of the highest amount of bans. <laughs> so well, oh. The laser belch tier list? But everyone does tier list after the fucking marathon. It reminds me of the same people who are like, Tofu, are you wearing those glasses to, to copy Barbarous King? Is it because I'm wearing shirts? You know what? Fuck it. No more shirts. Nope. No more shirts. Tofu, are you not wearing shirts because you want to be like simply? <laughs> oh shit, I got tattoos. We need a Twitch for politics. You spend bits to make an argument, put your money where your mouth is. All right, everyone give me your Twitch Prime. Damn, oh my God, that's actually never worked in my channel before. Chat, did you know? Come on. Did you know, chat, that your Twitch Primes that go unused are homeless. They don't have a home. And if you don't use them, it will remain homeless. And also, Jeff Bezos will Make profit on you being homeless. Guana Kosen, I will take your Twitch Prime in from the cardboard box that it was stained. The salt in my saliva is making it easier to tear up because it's irritating my eyes. Came across my desk, and it looks like your vehicle may be at risk of losing coverage. If you want to see the rest of the video, you're gonna have to type exclamation point YouTube and go subscribe to this video to see what happens next inside this clip. What do you mean subscribe to the video? Subscribe to the video, bitch. Here, you know what you do? You scroll down and then you see here and then you hit this and then subscribe. All right? Hi, my name is Sarah with the Ranger Division. Can you please verify that you're making model for a vehicle so we can pull off their file? Fuck you. Hit Boga should learn a thing or two. We have an unbanned request coming in from Hal. On my way to put meat's expensive beer in the microwave. Ugh. Ugh. Actually, fucking deny. Ew. What the fuck? Yeah, meats, I got your back on this one. Here's a question. If microwaving beer made you more drunk, would you still, would you, would you microwave it? Let's make a poll. Nope, by 90%. But there's 10% of you who would microwave your beer if it made you drunk faster. Hot take, hot Mountain Dew is good. You are, you are vile. Okay, honest question. For the rest of your life, you can only either drink warm beer or IPA. IPAs, you guys are all fooling yourselves. Okay. You have to either drink a warm IPA or bong water for the rest of your life. I'll just die. You like carbonated bong water? Okay, here's a good one. Here's a good one. Carbonated milk or ice cold bong water. Oh, uh, have you guys heard about the taste of carbonated milk? My name is Joe Barnard. I am here today to perform a very fun, informative, and socially acceptable experiment. It sounds so gross. Oh. Oh. <laughs> nah, All right, nope. so I say again, would you rather drink this or bong water? <laughs> and let's see how it is. This is the carbonated milk from the soda stream. Technically it really does look like cake, Elon. But, uh, you know, smells, smells like milk. Kind of looks like a uh, milkshake. <laughs> it's not the worst drink I've had, but it's also very close to the worst drink I've had. <laughs> it's bad and it's like a little spicy. Spicy? He takes another sip. Oh, I really, yeah. Alternate title, Elon Musk illegitimate son creates foam spicy <laughs> We have an unbanned request coming in from Iron Lappin. Banned? What's next? Y'all gonna call me bald too? Yes, you bald bitch. 
Welcome back. Dude, I just remembered. What did you just remember, me? Oh, I have seen multiple toilets where someone shat all over the fucking place. Not a single shit in the toilet. How do you do that? You know what I'm also more confused of? You ever go to a urinal and you see there's pubic hairs all over the rim of the urinal? How does that happen? How do you pull your dick out? Like what, you got like shaved pubic hair just sitting in your pants? You like fucking rest your nutsack on the fucking urinal and then like it sticks or, I, I don't get it. Shedding. Oh yeah, I still don't, I still don't get that. I still don't get it. Usually tear a few out and sprinkle them on the urinal to confuse people like you. Merkins exist? What is Merkins? It's a pubic wig, wig. Wait, what? Dude, I, I Google Merkins. And this fucking pops up. I don't know if this is TOS. A merkin is a pubic wig. Merkins were worn by sex workers after shaving their mons pubis and are now used as decorative items, erotic devices, or in films by both men and women. There's only one way to test for a merkin, and that's to grab the pubic hair by the fistful and yank as hard as you can. <laughs> I did. I did slurp it up like a banana noodle. Motherfucking missing. No, that counts. All right. First shot by Obsidian Orb. 24, 3, 2, 1. Hitting an air mine, narrowly avoiding some TNT into the muncher's mouth. You get another shot. So this 10 does not count as the final shot. Barely hitting a TNT into a second TNT. Getting a trampoline into, oh my God, we might have it. We might have it, come on. A little kitty that could. Three, ah. two, one. Landing on some TNT into an air mine into another air mine Honda trampoline avoiding some TNT he's got 1000 let's go let's see what incentive did you unlock I've got to beat Minecraft deathless with the new patch Hanukado you said you hate getting no shoes what is no shoes? You mean nauseous? Nauseous? Like that? No shoes, Gavnon. Oh, I spelled it wrong too, huh? Nauseous. Na nauseous. Na na Nauteous. Nauteous. <laughs> Mika, just go, just go. Jack off. The Mika that I first knew said he would jack off 12 times a day. And now look at him. He's gone 12 days without jacking it. My, how the tables have turned. You wallow in your own ejaculate. No, your mom's wallowing in my ejaculate. Not infrequently do I check my headphones. Mika, have you ever given yourself a prostate massage? You should like you've had the question ready for a while now. Everyone who gets a colonoscopy comes. Is that true? You just had one, it was awful. All these people revealing they've never touched their butthole before. That's gonna be the next question. Next time someone says, they had a colonoscopy. My immediate next question is going to be, did you come? And Jesus said, put the come button inside the butt. Would you guys hate me if I delayed bug snacks till Wednesday? You don't give a fuck about bug snacks. We already hate you. Just ban me right now. Excuses. Okay, I'm just, I'm not feeling up to having a super long stream today. What do you want me to tell you? Call us cunts and be done with it. Bye cunts. If you want to learn about sciencey stuff like vacuum decay or have trouble sleeping, I recommend YouTubing Sabine Hofstetter or PBS FaceTime. Or you could also YouTube Coke Guy Sucking Coke Bottle and you get this beautiful video. Ready for it? <laughs> yeah. All right. We're, let's 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 switch to Elden Ring. This is so stupid.